minuto antes. Okay, my dear students, so let's see. Solamente déjenme acá que, permítanme que me equivoqué de diapositiva. Si no me equivoco. Okay, ah, no, this is the correct one. Okay, this is the correct one. Yes, yes, it is. Okay, so today you are going to present to me your private information. Okay, so according to where do you born, where do you grow up, what do you do when you were a little child, so what do you like to do, so about your family, about your parents, so about your favorite teacher. Teacher, so, have a question. Antes yes. que todo. Please, ¿Cómo Diana. se dice eh, 2021 en inglés? 2021. 2021. 2021, yes. Okay. Excellent, yes. You're welcome. Yes, Alex, welcome. Eh, igual una fecha, 2014, ¿cómo se pronuncia? 2000, porque es 2000, vea. 2014, de 14. Dividí el 20, 14. Entonces, 20, en este caso lo vamos a decir así como 2000. 2000, 2000. Oh. 2014. 2014. Yes. Okay, thank you. So, another question, my dear students? Yes, teacher, me. Okay, Cari. And, uh, donde dice, uh, I, used to, I used to, uh, yo quiero poner, uh, jugar con mis amigos, play with my friends, pero en la calle, no sé cómo. Vaya, primero es, yo solía jugar, ¿verdad? Sí. I used to play on, on the street, ahí se lo mando al chat, on the street with my friends. Ahí está. I okay, used to play, you. I used to play on the street, on the street with my friends. Mayra, 1973. Vamos a dividir 19 y 73, o sea que en este caso sería 19, 19, y 73, 73, repito, 1973, repito, 1973, vamos a hacer un repaso, un review de los números más adelante, yo sé que con el teacher Ricardo lo vieron, pero vamos a hacer un repaso más adelante de los números, ¿les parece? Hay una forma bien sencilla de aprenderse los yes, números. Teacher, please. Ok, hay una forma bien sencilla de aprenderse los yes, números. Teacher. Ok, vamos a ver si la otra semana los, los repasamos. Vamos a ver, yo, y les voy a enseñar, porque es bien fácil, aprenderse los números es bien fácil. No, no hay necesidad que usted comience. One, two, three. No, no hay necesidad. O sea, hay una técnica ahí. So, another question more. Five, four, three, two. Two, one. Okay, so remember, number one, please try to speak fluently. Trate de hablar fluidamente. Cuando digo fluidamente, tenga cuidado con el tiempo. No vaya leyendo despacio, sino que lea normal. Yo sé que leemos despacio, en este caso, para como que supuestamente vamos a pronunciar bien, pero en realidad esa no es la técnica. Usted si va a leer su información, léala, pero trate de, en este caso, como cuando leemos un artículo en español. Punto número dos. Si yo no lo corrijo, es porque usted no tiene errores. Y ojo, usted siga hablando, siga habl no, 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 no se interrumpa usted solo, no se interrumpa usted sola, porque yo en el chat voy a ir escribiendo los errores de pronunciación. Entonces, cuando usted termine de dar su exposición, yo se los mando, ¿ok? Yo se los mando, pero usted exponga y no me vaya a preguntar, teacher, ¿cómo se pronuncia? O sea, usted dele. Y después yo le ayudo con la pronunciación, si tiene alguna palabra en este caso, vean. So, I'm going to start this, I'm going to start this evaluation as a volunteer. So, who wants, quien quiere, who wants to be the first one? Me teacher, please. Okay, Majo, please. Are you ready? Yes, teacher, all the time. Yes, teacher. Okay, Majo, please go ahead. Excellent. I was born in El Salvador. 
I grew up in Zacatecoluca. When I was young, I was living with my grandmother. I was a very shy but kind uh, young girl. I sometimes visited to my father's family and grandmother. I was not living with my father. I loved played with my cousin and neighbors. My sister was living with my father and her mother in Guatemala while I was living with my grandmother in El Salvador. My parents were met at 1995 for mutual friends. And I went to public high school. I used to sleep after school and then I played with my cousin. I was a host irresponsibility student because nobody helped me to do my homework at high school. Uh, my favorite teacher was literature teacher at, at high school and in college where the psychology clinical and organizational teacher and Dr. Helga at neuropsychology subject. I remember they because they loved the profession and always told more uh, than or did. My favorite sport was volleyball. volleyball. And my favorite oh. friends were kind, funny, and smart. My favorite TV program uh, was Madagascar Penguins. And then. Finish, excellent. Okay, Majo, just two mistakes. Yo a veces, te, yo, a veces, yo a veces visitaba, o sea, yo, por ejemplo, yo a veces visitaba a mis abuelos. Si yo digo, I sometimes visit my grandparents, es como que esté diciendo hoy en, pre, en el tiempo presente. Ah, yo a veces visito a mis abuelos, pero como yo quiero que usted me diga, ah, yo a veces tenía que, o sea, estamos hablando de many, many years ago, de muchos años atrás, entonces necesito que me le agreguen el verbo have, que es el auxiliar. I sometimes have. Y el siguiente verbo visitar cae en pasado simple. I sometimes have visited my grandparents. Un ejemplo, ¿verdad? Ok, yo era muy irresponsable. La palabra irresponsable, el adjetivo se dice irresponsible. Irresponsible. Así que dos detallitos bien chiquitos. Excelente, Majo. Thank you so much. Volunteer, please. Who wants to be the second? Thank you. Me, teacher. Okay, America, excellent. Thank you. Please, America, go ahead. Okay. I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was living in San Salvador. I was a very friendly and modest young girl. But, um, um, Sorry, teacher, I'm going to repeat. When I was young, I was living in San Salvador, but now I am, I am live in Santa Tecla City. I was a very friendly and modest young girl. I sometimes had played with my friends and sisters. I was no selfish and arrogant young girl. I love walk, in the field and go to the river with my family. My sister were studying, studying high school while I was in middle school. My mother was traveling in 2000. I went to public, public high school. I used to go, uh, to go by bus to school. I was a applied and polite student. My favorite teacher was Mr. Mr. Alvarenga. I remember him because he was very smart and kind. And he encouraged me to study psychology. My favorite sport was softball. We played, we played every week. My favorite friends were charming enthusiastic and nice. My favorite TV program, program were the Phil Flintstone, Candy, and Heidi. Heidi, that's all. Wow, excellent, zero mistakes. Maybe just one. 
Heidi. Heidi, no, okay, Heidi. Yes, Heidi, Heidi. yes. Okay. Congrats. Good job, America. Really nice. Thank you. Thank you with T. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> with T, T H, right? <laughs> no, thank you. Excellent. No more. Thank you so much, America. Thank you. Please take a rest. Okay, volunteer, please. Who wants to uh, yo, be? Violeta. Perfect. Violet, welcome to your class. How are you? How are you? Fine. I'm fine. Excellent. You? I'm fine. Thanks <laughs> for asking. I'm ready to I'm ready to listen to your oral presentation. Are you ready? Yes. 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 Okay. Please, Violet. Yes, I did. Excellent. Okay. Please go ahead. I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was living in San Marcos. I was a very good reader, young girl. Sometimes I would fight with my younger brother because got into mischief. I know if it's pronounced bien, but mischief. Um, I was not. What is? Excuse keeping... me. What is? What is mischief? I I I didn't. Eh, travesuras. Ah, like a troubles. Okay, like a, yes, Mitch. Yes, it is excellent. Okay. Uh, I was not skipping class class until the ninth grade. Uh, I love being being on the school folk dance team. My cousin was living in the United States while. I live in San Marcos. My parents were living together until uh, 2011. I went to a national institute in high school. Hola, perdón. Okay, Hola. please continue. Sí. Uh, I used to take the bus to go to study, to study. I was a good student. My favorite teacher was the third cycle, cycle. No sé cómo se dice cycle. Okay, yes it is, cycle. Cycle, math and ciencia teacher. I remember her because she believed in me and respected me. My favorite sport was baseball, but I was not, or I wasn't an athlete, atleta. Athlete. Athlete. My favorite friends were from college. My favorite TV show was Six. No sé si lo estoy pronunciando bien. Six Sense. Sexto sentido. Okay. Sense. Okay. Mm -hmm. Finish. I finish. Okay. Excellent. Thank you so much, Violet. Okay. Let's see. The correct word, the correct adjective for travesuras, because it is a noun, is antics. Antics. antics yes because the measures is a kind of it is it's, it's not a noun so you need to use an adjective so antics like a uh, travesuras okay. it, it, it is a um it is the correct one and it is an informal way too okay la materia de ciencias es science science con ese in, iniciamos con ese es science science is science. science yes Porque ella o él creyó en mí. La, en este caso, la preposición no es in me, sino que se dice believe on me. On me. Exactly. For example, ah, ¿Por my... qué no in me o on me? Porque in es una preposición que cuando algo está adentro de. Y on es cuando algo está sobre. Por ejemplo, ella, te, es, ella creyó en usted porque estuvo todo el tiempo sobre usted, pendiente de usted. Por eso es que es on. Porque en este caso, in es cuando digo, por ejemplo, um, the cat is in the box. ¿Por qué? Porque está adentro de la, dentro de la caja. caja. Exacto. 
Y la pronunciación de atleta, athlete. Athlete. TH, athlete. 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 Yes, la TH, athlete. Ok, Violet, excellent. Thank you, congrats. Ok, please. Gracias. You're welcome. Volunteer, please. Me teacher. Ok, Me teacher. excellent. I got, I got, ok. Eh, cuando digan mi teacher, manténgame activado el micrófono porque a veces no alcanzo a ver quiénes lo activan. Ok, uh, number one, Diana. Brenda <laughs> Rodríguez, number two, Diana, number three, Karina, and number four, Luis. Ok, so I got Brenda, Diana, Karina, and Luis. Ok, Brenda Rodríguez, I'm going to start with you. Are you ready? Yes, teacher, I'm ready. Excellent. Thank you so much. Okay, Brenda, nos preparamos, Diana. Go ahead. Okay, good evening, uh, everyone. Well, um, I was born in El Salvador. I grew up, grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was living in San Martin. I was a very quiet and friendly girl. I sometimes liked to help my mom to cook. I was not get out so much. I liked to be at home. I loved having cats in my house. My brother was getting married when I was 12 years old. My parents were living in the Cabanas department for 25 years. I went to Prevex High School. I used watching my favorite series at afternoon. I was a responsible student. My favorite teacher was the English teacher. I remember her because she always explained the class very well and the classes were entertaining. My favorite sport was soccer. My favorite friends were all the ones in my classroom. My favorite TV program was the Flintstones because we are very funny. Excellent, thank you, Brenda, Miss Rodriguez. Thank so, you. look at the pronouns. So, tuvimos problemas de gramática, ninguno, y eso es muy bien. Pero tuvimos ciertos detalles de pronunciación. Por ejemplo, I grew up. Yo crecí. I grew up. Repeat, I grew up. I grew up. Excellent. Ok, vamos con la pronunciación de niña o muchacha. No se dice girls, es con E. Girl. 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 Girl, ok. Y vamos otra vez con el adjetivo. ¿Cómo se dice irresponsable? Irresponsible. Responsible. Irresponsible. I irresponsible. Esa es la forma negativa y la forma positiva responsible. Responsible. Okay. Excelente. Detallitos de pronunciación. En gramática la estructura muy buena, muy buena Brenda, excelente. Eh, hay una gran diferencia Thank entre you. gramática y pronunciación, ¿verdad? O sea, gramática es como usted lo escribe y pronunciación obviamente es como pronunciamos las palabras. Ok, number two, Diana, are you ready? Yes. Excelente. So the next one is Karina, please, and then Luis. Okay, please, Diana, go ahead. Yes, okay, wait. <laughs> okay. Okay, uh, good evening. Uh, I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was living in Zacatecoluca. Um, I was a very outgoing young girl. Um, I sometimes have visited my aunt on Saturday. I was not participating in nothing at the school. I love to eat tacos and chocolate. Um, I, well, my brother was studying high school where, while I was studying first grade and my parents were getting married on 2021. 
I went to private high school. I used to watch TV after school. I was a irresponsible student. My favorite teacher was um, English teacher. Um, I remember her because she was a good teacher and she was a very kind. And my favorite sport was soccer. My favorite friends were very funny and easy going to. And finally, my favorite TV program was the little the little strawberry and SpongeBob because they were funny. Thank you. Okay, excellent. Pretty nice, Diana. Zero mistakes. Perfect. The grammar is good. Your pronunciation is good. So now you have to work in your time. Okay. It's like a, I went to a private school. So okay, I went to a private school. Okay. La la el tiempo. Okay. El tiempo, la velocidad es la única, lo único que vamos a trabajar, Diana. Excelente. Cero errores. Muy bien. Thank you. Let's continue. Karina Canales, are you ready? Ready, teacher. Excellent. <coughs> And then, could you please, Luis, nos preparamos. And then, Jocelyn Escobar. Ok, Karina, go ahead. Ok. Uh, good evening, uh, teacher and student. I was born in a, a watch upon department. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was living in Ciudad Merliot, but now live in Soyapango. I was a very old boy, young girl. I sometimes have visited my family in my town. I was not participating in nothing at school. I loved to sleep after school. My brother was a very easy going young boy. My parents were separate. I grew up along with my mom. I went to uh, private high school. I used to play on the street with my friends. I was a responsible student. My favorite teacher was math teacher. I remember him because he was a very dedicated. I remember, uh, sorry, my favorite sport was uh, basketball and football. My favorite friends were uh, very funny. And my favorite TV program was uh, Beverly Hills, 90210, uh, Rugrats, and Full House. Full House, hey, I remember Full House, I, I like it. It is still on Netflix. If you want to watch it again, Karina, it is available. It is available on Netflix. Okay, so let's see, Karina, just one mistake. This is, no, hey, saben lo que me gusta, que no he tenido errores de gramática. O sea, la escritura estamos muy bien. Detalles de pronunciación es nada más. La única palabra, Karina, private. Like a private school. Repeat after me, private. Private. Excellent. O sea, yo fui a una escuela o a un colegio privado. I went to a private school. Private school. Una vez un alumno me dijo, en lo que se prepara Luis, una vez un alumno me dijo, I went to a private college. Porque él pensó que colegio se decía college. Y en realidad colegio, perdón, en realidad college viene siendo universidad también. Entonces, si yo quiero decir colegio y dar a entender que era un colegio privado, private y se mantiene el school. Ah, escuela pública, public. Con o, public school. Ok, Luis, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready, teacher. Excellent. Good And evening, then, people. good evening. Thank you. Welcome to your class. And then, could you please, Jocelyn Escobar, thank you. Please be ready because you are the second. Ok, Luis, go ahead. I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in Chalatenango Department. When I was young, I was living in Chalatenango but now I live in Merliot City. Was very boyfriend, young man, but not, but not no. And sometime he visit my uncle in San Salvador in the Soyapango City. I was not an angry kid. I was always happy. I love it. I love it to ride horse. My brother was my best friend. 
and teacher in my life. My parents celebrated their 50th of anniversary. I went to public high school in Chalatenango. I was a responsible, responsible student. student. My favorite teacher was mathematic teacher. I remember him because he was my counselor in all my subjects. My favorite sport was football. My favorite friends were very clever and all we were very happy. My favorite TV program was Messenger T and He Man because they were so entertaining. Finish. Finish. Excellent. Thank you. Just three mistakes. De el verbo, el verbo tener, se dice have, no hate, have. Por ejemplo, en este caso, I sometimes have visit, have. Repeat, have. Have. And the second. I have visit. Excellent. I sometimes have visit. The second, enojado, en, con e, angry. Angry. Angry, excellent. And the last one, anniversary. Anniversary. Anniversary, okay, anniversary. Okay. 50, como se dice 50. 50, yes, 50 anniversary. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, thank you. You're welcome, really nice, excellent. Me gusta porque nos estamos teniendo problemas de gramática. O, o sea, eh, se, se nota que han puesto mucha atención en esa parte de la gramática y eso es muy importante. Excelente, señores. Muy bien. So, Jocelyn, are you ready? Yes, teacher. Ok, Miss Escobar, please. The stage is yours. Go ahead. I was born in San Juan Opico. I grew, I grew up in San Juan Opico. When I was you, I was living in Komasawa. I was a very ace going you here. I something I visit me cousin. I was not if he particip participated in a school, for example, in dance and dramas. I love eating ceviches and Mexican food. My brother, my brother was younger than me. He was eight years old and I was 14 years old. My parents were very strict. I went to public high school. I used to head along very well with my friends and teacher. I was a very, a very distract, distracted student in class. My favorite teacher was history. I remember him. I remember him because he was so good a daily story and very dynamic so as not to head. My favorite sport was football. My favorite friends were fun, full of life with of attitude. My favorite TV program was Lazy Tom. Finish. Okay, excellent. Thank you, Jocelyn. So, repeat after me. Cuando yo quiero decir, ojo, ah, o sea, yo ya pasé, ya me puedo quedar relajado, relajado, como ya pasé, ya me voy a tomar mi café, etc. Tómese su cafecito, pero ponga atención a las correcciones que yo le hago a sus compañeros, porque puede ser que esas mismas correcciones o esos mismos detalles los tenga usted también. So, la palabra más joven que la pronunciación, younger. Younger. Excellent. Vamos con público o pública. Public. Public. Excelente. Aunque la segunda vez te corregiste tú misma, pero ok, public. Vamos con distraído. Okay. Un, una estudiante distraída o un estudiante distraído. Distract. 
Distract. A student. A student. Ok, porque no se dice distracted, ¿verdad? Sino que distract a student. Ok. Distract Vamos, a student. A student. Excelente. Vamos con dinámico o dinámica. Cuando alguien, una persona muy dinámica, die, en este caso. Vamos a ver, hay un detalle acá. Hasta ahorita me acabo de fijar. ¿Tú quieres decir que tus amigos eran muy dinámicos? Sí. Ok, entonces me voy a corregir. La palabra dinámica es cuando yo digo, ok, chicos, vamos a hacer una dinámica en clases. Ok, guys, we are going to do a, dyna a dynamic. Ok, eso es cuando vamos a hacer una dinámica. Pero si yo quiero decir que mis amigos eran dinámicos, se dice, ahí te lo mando al chat, ahorita lo estoy escribiendo, active. Mis amigos eran muy dinámicos, like a active students, active friends. O sea, eran bien dinámicos, ¿verdad? Entonces, dynamic aplica cuando vamos a hacer una dinámica en clase. Vamos, tenemos problemas otra vez con el verbo have. No se dice have, se dice have. Have. Oh. Y la última, actitud, se dice con R. Attitude. Attitude. Excelente, attitude. Okay. Yo sé que tenemos la doble T, pero según la fonética, pasa la doble T como R, Ari, attitude. Attitude. Excelente, thank you, Jocelyn. Really nice. Detallitos thank nada you, más. Jocelyn. Perfect. Me alegra yeah. porque el problema de gramática, yo pensé que gramática iba a corregir, fíjense, y solo estoy corrigiendo pronunciación. Ok, muy bien. Volunteer, please. Who's missing? I think, let's see, Abby, Adriana, Alejandra, Alex, Claudia, Paola, Valerie. Uy, uh, tengo varios. Ok. My teacher. My teacher. <laughs> ok, let's see. Claudia Alvarado, number one. Mayra Alvarado, number two. And Brenda Flores, number three. Si se me quedó alguien. And Me teacher. Me teacher. Ok. Alejandra Ramírez, number four. Hasta ahí me quedo. No se preocupe que vamos a pasar todo. Pero hasta ahí me quedo porque si no se me olvida. Ok. So, number one. Who's number one? Who's number one? Thank you. Ya ven, hasta ustedes se les ha olvidado. Who's number one? Claudia Alvarado, yes. <laughs> Ok, <risa> ya ve, a ustedes le había olvidado. Que no me lo <risa> ok, pero igual, igual. Bueno, a para tomar pero... Café. <risa> no, pero no se preocupen que todos vamos a pasar. Ok, so, Claudia, ¿estás listo? Sí, sí. Ok, excelente, thank you. So, let's see, se me olvidó quiénes eran las demás, solo me acuerdo que, Dios mío, tengo que tomar full scroll, ya se me olvidó quién eran las demás, solo me acuerdo que tenía... Creo que era Mayra sí, Alvarado. ¿Por qué no pones una listita ahí en el chat y que cada quien pues sepa su orden? Sí, fíjate, cabal, no, o con la manita como hacían con el teacher Richard. No, pero todos pasan, no te preocupes, no te preocupes, don't worry about it. Ok, so, Claudia, please, the stage is yours. Um, I, was, I was born in El Salvador. I grew in San Salvador when I was young. I live in Boulevard. I was very easy going. I sometimes I have visited my father and mother. I was not, I am participate in school. I love to eat taco. My brother and sister, I was studying English in the week. My parents were sent Mary on nineteen eighty. I went to private high school. I used to move it. My favorite teacher I was in the in second grade. I remember my hair, my cheese because I felt I love, I was very happy. My favorite sport I was baseball. Favorite friend where it was Sylvia. We are studying in high school. My favorite TV 
program program um the Flintstone um Astro Boy. Finish. Okay, so let's see, Claudia. There are some mistakes, a kind of a, a, grammar and pronunciation, but okay, let's focus on the pronouns. Grew up. Grew up. Yo crecí. I grew up. I grew up. La otra palabra, participando. Participating. Participating. La siguiente, no se dice in. En este caso, para decir la, en, el fin de semana, se dice on the week. On the week. La siguiente, para decir privado, private. 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 La siguiente, Private. segundo grado, second grade. Second grade. Excelente. La, la clase queda grabada, así que no se preocupe porque lo pueden ver otra vez. Thank you, Claudia. Thank you so much. Okay. Really nice participation. So, number two, please. Number two. I said number two, Mayra. Excellent. Mayra Alvarado. Okay, Mayra, please. Go yes. ahead. Yes, teacher. I was born in El Salvador. I grow, grow in El Salvador when I, I was young, living in Constitución. I was every a boy, young boy. I sometimes have visit my grabs on holiday i was not participate in in i not participate in at school i love to eat pupusa and pizza my brother was studying at my at the morrison school my parents were great great married in 1973, I went to public, public in school. I used to watch television, television from doing Howard. I was excellent and responsible student. My favorite teacher was my teacher Ceci. I remember him because he was cheerful. I help us with a problem we did not understand. My favorite sport was basketball. My favorite, my favorite was where my world to get it well still. My favorite program was Dr. House, Phoenix. Excellent. Okay, so Mayra, repeat after me. Tenemos, te, seguimos, seguimos en el programa con la palabra crecí. I grew up. I grew up. La palabra joven, young. Young. La palabra casarse, get married. Get married. La siguiente, escuela pública, siempre es con O, señores, es con O, no es con U. Public school. Public, ok, yes, oops. Eh, Mayra, yes, please. Public yes. school, ok, repeat, public school. Public school. La palabra tarea, homework. Homework. Y como en este caso, cuando hablamos de U, cuando hablamos de tercer, tercer grado, Adriana se dice third, third grade. Third grade. Ok, cuando hablamos en este caso, por ejemplo, yo la recuerdo a ella, se dice I remember her. Her. Porque tú eh, eh, empezó hablando de, de que era o era ella, o era él, el punto fue de que, cuando yo digo, yo la recuerdo a ella, I remember her, yo lo recuerdo a él, I remember, I remember his. 
Ok, y la última, seguimos teniendo problemas con el verbo tener, no es hate. Yo no sé por qué no lo pronuncian así, hey, es have. Have. Ok. Excellent, thank you. Thank you, Mayra. Really nice. Ok, number three. I don't know if Paola o... Or... Yes, who's number three, please? Yes, teacher. Ok, Paola, excellent, thank you. Ok, so Paola, number three. Brenda Flores, number four. And Valerie, number five. Ok, okay teacher, Paola. Hello. Give me a second. Ok, please, excellent. Hey, la pronunciación esa de have, el verbo tener es have, ok? Es have. I have, yo tengo. I have, yo tengo. You have, tú tienes. Tú tienes. You have a house, tú tienes una casa, ok? So, Paolita, please, ready? Yes, teacher. Ok, yes. nice. So, se prepara Brenda and then Valerie. Ok, Paola, go ahead. I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was living in Cuscatancingo. I was a very outgoing young girl. I sometimes fought with my brother to see who will take care of my sister. I was not being in trouble. I love playing soccer at school and I love being in the games against other schools. My brother was living in San Francisco while my sister and me were leaving her. My parents were going to travel to see my brother. I went to private high school. I used to watch my favorite show after school. I was a very responsible and intelligent student. My favorite teacher was chemistry teacher. I remember him because he was a good teacher. It helped it helped us was a was a H class in a fun way. My favorite sport was soccer, volleyball, basketball, and handball. My favorite friends were very smart and very going. My favorite TV program, TV program was the Supersonic, Candy, and Dragon Ball Hitty. <laughs> excellent, <laughs> excellent, Paola. See no mistakes, no grammar mistakes, and that's a really nice pronunciation too. Congrats. So continue improving, Thank okay? You. Excellent, continue improving. So Brenda Flores and then Valerie and then Abby Usman. Okay, Brenda. Miss Flores, are you ready? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Okay, Valerie, nos yes, separamos. Teacher. Perfect. Go ahead, Brenda. Thank you. I was I was more in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was joined, I was living in Soyapango. I was a very east going here. And sunlight have visit park on Sunday. I was not participate in nothing at school. I love to eat pupusas and pizza. My sister was a student high school when I was a student to grade. My parents were heading Mary on 1992, I went to public high school. I used to dance after school. I was a responsible student. My favorite was Matt's teacher. I remember her because she was a good teacher and very friendly. My favorite sport was um, basketball and soccer. My favorite friends were very smart and easy going too. My favorite TV program was Supersonic, Stanberry Shortcase and Power Ranger. Finish. Okay, okay, let's see. There are many, many uh, mistakes about pronouns. So, 
let's see i got this one and let's see i got okay program okay so group up repeat after me group up programs grew yo crecí i grew up i grew up vamos con la siguiente responsible Responsible. Responsible. Ok, la siguiente was not. Was not. Y la última, program. Program. Ok, excelente, Brenda. Tenemos que practicar la pronunciación, ok? Thank, Thank you. you. In general, excellent. Thank you so much. Ok, Valerie, and then I'm going to continue with Abby Usman. Hello, Valerie. Are you ready? Yes, teacher. <laughs> okay, please, Valerie, go ahead. I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was Boulevard Constitución. I was a very outgoing young girl. I sometimes have visit my aunt on Saturday. I was I was not participating nothing in class because I am very shy. I love to eat pizza and tacos. My sister was work while I study. My parents were getting married on 2000. I went to private high school. I used to watch television after school. I was a responsible student. My favorite teacher was English. I remember him because she was a good teacher. My favorite sport was volleyball. My favorite friend were is Genesis, very, because very smart and very friendly with everyone. My favorite TV program was the Dora, Explora the Dora Exploradora and Heidi. Finish, okay, so Dora the Exploradora. Dora the Explorer. Dora the Explorer. Okay, Dora the Explorer. excellent, se prepara Abby. Ok, Valerie, un detalle. Tú dijiste, yo lo recuerdo a él porque ella fue, en este caso, ¿era teacher femenino o masculino? Femenino. Entonces sería, I remember her because she. Yeah. Exacto. Ah. Y tú dijiste, I remember his. O sea, I remember, yo lo recuerdo a él porque ella era. O sea, el contraste, en este caso, de gramática. En pronunciación estamos muy bien. Detalles de gramática contigo, como por ejemplo, I remember, I remember her, yo la recuerdo a ella, her. Aparte que her es para femenino y his es para masculino. Entonces, yo la recuerdo a ella porque ella fue paciente, un ejemplo. O sea, I remember her because she was very patient. ¿Ok? Teacher. Excellent. Thank you, Valerie. Nice. Ok, Abby Usman. Hello. Hello, teacher. Ready? I am ready. Excellent. No, but teacher de las siete, estoy listo en un café. <laughs> ok, Abby, please, go ahead. I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was living in Delgado City. I was a very outgoing, going, young girl. I sometimes have worked with my own. I was no participating in the nothing at the school. I love to join rock and eat candies and drink cocaine. My brothers and sister was my sister studies high school with my little brother playing. My dad was very friendly and very worker. I went to public high school. I used to 
play video games after school and play basketball for evening in the shores. I was a responsible student. My favorite teacher was history. I remember her because she was good teacher and very kind. My favorite sport was basketball. My favorite friends was very loving and intelligent. Her name is Carmen. My favorite TV program was The Wonderful Years and Dinosaurs and Jean, Jean Saturday, The Trumpet Chacal Special. Finish. Me encantaba eh, esa, esa serie de los años maravillosos. Deberían de pasarla en Netflix. Buenísima. Eh. Yes. Ok, so, look at. La pronunciación de Coca-Cola se dice Coca. Repeat, Abby. Cock. Excelente. Cuando yo quiero decir, mi papá fue un trabajador muy fuerte, o sea, trabajaba mucho, era un muy buen trabajador. Se dice hard worker. Work, worker, creí que había dicho eso. Sí, <risa> pero... pero dije, okay. Ajá, entonces, pero cuando yo quiero referir que la persona trabaja mucho, o sea, un muy buen trabajador, se dice hard worker. Hard work. Exacto. Okay. Me dijo worker, pero no me dijo hard. O sea, hard worker. Así como que un buen empleado, un buen trabajador. Una persona que trabaja mucho, vea. Vamos con la pronunciación de favorito. Favorite. Favorite. Excelente. Y vamos con la pronunciación de amigo o amigos. Friend. Friend. Exacto, con E. Friend. Okay. Friend. Y sí, plural. Sí, digo friend. <ríe> no, pero son detalles que podemos corregir. Y plural es friends. 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 Exacto. Excelente. Thank you, Abby. Thank you so much. Los demás, pongan atención a ese tipo de detalles de pronunciación. O sea, ahorita yo sé que muchos ya están con el teléfono en la mano, pero no, pongan atención a los detallitos de pronunciación. Solo es una hora diaria, ¿ok? Aprovechemos esa horita diaria. Ok, please, volunteer. Who's missing? ¿Quién falta? Sí. Lisandro, me teacher. excelente. Me teacher. Lisandro, number one. Me. Alex, number two. Jocelyn, ¿no has pasado, hija? No. Ok, Jocelyn, me number teacher. three. En Alejandra, number four. Excelente. Adriana de Paz, number five. Ok, Lisandro, please, go ahead. Ok. Uh, I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was young, I was living in Santa Marta. I was a very outgoing young boy. I sometimes went to church on Sundays with my mom. I was not very focused at, uh, at school. I loved to eat pizza and pasta. My sister was studying at the university while I was studying three THs, TH grade. My parents were getting married on 2006. I went to public high school. I used to play Mario War after dinner. I was a responsible student. My favorite teacher was Matt. I remember here because she was como paciencia como decía patience. ¿Cómo? Patient. Patient. Paciente. Patient. Yes. Okay. <laughs> My favorite sport was volleyball. My favorite friends were y were very funny. My favorite TV program was Dragon Ball Z, Rana, SpongeBob, and Kid Butowski. Ok, fíjate que casi te ibas intacto, Lisandro. Ok, tenemos detalles siempre con la palabra público. Es con O, no es con U, es con O. Se dice public, ok? Public. Repeat, public. 
public. Excellent. Okay, y antes de continuar, quiero enseñarles dos palabras. Se las, uy, ¿qué me pasó aquí? Se las voy a mandar a el chat. Esta, estas dos palabras son muy importantes. La primera es... La primera es, permítanme acá, pa, ok, pa, si, eh, ok. La primera es paciencia. Se repite y se pronuncia patient. Patient. Muchas veces los alumnos tienden a confundirse con la palabra paciente. La palabra paciente, la palabra paciente es patient. Termina con, te, miren, estas, estas son de las palabras estresantes para todos los que estamos aprendiendo inglés. Porque la primera termina como con S, patience, 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 que es una persona, que, es una persona que tiene paciencia. Y en la siguiente es, una, es un paciente, o sea, como ir a la clínica, un paciente. Entonces, las, en este caso, paciencia. Paciencia, patient, patient, patient. Y en el caso de la otra es patient. T, t, con T. Es una palabra, como nosotros siempre le llamamos palabras, eh, ay, se me fue la palabra, eh, que nos estresan la vida porque tiene una similitud como la palabra ant. Ant, hormiga y también es tía. Ok, detallitos nada más, detallitos nada más. Y suena, o sea, la otra es passion, la otra es pasión, passion. Patience, patient and passion. Patience, paciente, de paciencia, que tiene paciencia. Patient, una persona que es un paciente de una clínica. Y la otra es passion, de pasión, passion. Ok, so, excellent, thank you. Let's continue. Teacher, si no pasamos hoy, pasamos mañana. Sí, no se preocupe, ok. No se preocupe que si no pasamos hoy, pasamos mañana. Ok, Lisandro, number one. And number two, who's number two, please? Me, teacher. Alex, thank you. Yes. Go ahead, please. Okay, I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Juan Pico. When I was young, I was living in Joya de Serén. I was a very ace going young boy. I sometimes visit my grandmother and my cousin. And I was not particip participating. ¿Cómo se pronuncia esa palabra que se pronuncia? Participating. Participating. Okay, ya, les dije, ya les dije, no hagan pausa, que okay? yo después los corrijo, okay. okay? Yes. Participating in nothing at school. Uh, I love to eat pizza and vegetable. My my partner, eh, perdón, per, my sister was in kindergarten when I was in second year of high school. My parents got married in 2014. I went to public high school. I use I used to play uh, I used to play soccer after school. I was a responsible student. My favorite teacher was English teacher. I remember Hein because we have a good teacher. We he explained with so great patience and very good dedication. My favorite sport was soccer and basketball. My favorite friend, friends uh, were very late, but I liked to play uh, a lot of soccer. My favorite TV shows was Dragon Ball Z because I like to, to see the transformation. I thought I had powers. Finish. Excellent. Ok, detalles. Vamos con la primera. Participating. 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 Vamos con vegetales. Vegetables. Vegetables. Vamos con eh, jardín de niños. Kindergarten. 
kindergarten. Vamos con responsable, responsible. Responsible. Femenino, cuando yo que yo lo recuerdo a yo la recuerdo a ella, I remember her. I remember her. I remember. Y yo lo recuerdo a él. I remember his. I remember his. Y la última, dedication. Dedication. Excellent. Thank you, Alex. Really nice. Perfect. Okay. Who's next, please? Number. Okay, Lisandro. One. Okay, Jocelyn. Thank you so much. Okay, Jocelyn, please go ahead. Good evening, teacher and student. I was born in San Salvador. I grew up in Apopa. When I was young, I living was in Apopa. But today I live in the department of Sonsonate. I was very easy going to get. I sometimes look after of my two brothers and my sister. I was prepared to participate. I was not prepared to participate in a soccer tournament. I love to eat candies, cakes, and pizza. My, my sister was living in Spain while I was living in a papa. My parents were very loving and helped me a lot to study. I went to private, no, perdón. I went to private high school. I used to study a lot in the mornings. I was a responsible student. My favorite teacher was history teacher. I remember him because he was on, he was one of my best friends. He taught me many things about life and of history. My favorite sport was soccer. My favorite friends were Iris and Sarah. They were very pretty and smart. My favorite pro TV program was Great Anatomy and Friends. Finish. Ok. Fíjate, yo sé que es bien interesante. Porque te, aunque te fuiste es una muy lento, al menos yo en mi caso, no sé si tus compañeros, pero yo en mi caso no identifiqué ningún error. Tal vez en la última de Grace Anatomy, la, la, el detalle de, de Grace Anatomy, pero en general no, de pronunciación no, no, no identifiqué. Ahora bien, hubo una palabra que no, no pude comprenderla al inicio, Ajá. pero sí, por el tiempo sería, sería mentirte recordarte cuánto, pero muy bien, excelente la técnica. Vamos a trabajar nada más en este caso la fluidez y el tiempo, ¿ok? La fluidez y el tiempo. Excelente. Thank you, Jocelyn. Nice. Ok, please. Who's next? Teacher, ya nos Me pasamos teacher. de la hora. Nos pasamos dos minutos. Ok, Alejandrita, please. Go ahead and then, Adriana, are you ready? Yes, teacher. Ok, so Alejandra and then Adriana. Creo que no me falta nadie. Yo creo que solo hay dos. Ok, Alejandra, please. Go ahead. I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in San Salvador. When I was gone, I was living in Santa Tecla. I was very chic grand girl. I sometimes I went to with my cousins. I went not from many friends. I love eat candies. My brother went to college. When was in school, my parents were the backup. In 2020, I went to Pride Mirren School. I was asleep in the afternoon. My favorite teacher is English grammar. I remember him because very happy, many dynamic, dynamics. My sport, my favorite sport, rhythmic gymnastics. My favorite friends were happy, funny, and intelligent. My favorite TV program was Marta Speak and the Blue 
eh, tracks. Excelente, muy bien. Alejandra, dos detalles. Yo era muy tímida. I was a very shy girl. Por ejemplo, yo era una niña muy tímida. So shy, la pronunciación es shy. En este caso, lo pronunciaste bien. El detalle fue el verbo. Dijiste es, I am, o lo dijiste en presente, pero igual, en este caso, I was a very shy girl. La siguiente, eh, mi maestro, mi maestra favorita fue la de gramática. En este caso, no es necesario que digas English grammar. Solo se puede ir de un solo. Was my grammar teacher. Y ya se entiende que es gramática en inglés en este caso. Ok, detallitos. Okay, teacher. Thank Excelente. You. You're welcome. So I'm going to conclude the class. I'm going to finish your presentation with Adriana de Paz. Are you ready? Yes, teacher. Ok, Adriana, please go ahead. I was born in El Salvador. I grew up in La Libertad. When I was young, I was living in Antiguo Cuscatlán. I was a very smiling young girl, and sometimes I visit my grandmother on um, Sunday. I was not participating in nothing at school. I loved to eat chocolate. My sister was students high school while I was students third grade. My parents were getting married in 2000 and I went to public high school. I used to read a book after school. I was a responsible student. My favorite teacher was language teacher. I remember her because she was a good teacher. She support me all the time. My favorite favorite sport was football. My favorite friends were very smart. My favorite TV program was SpongeBob. SpongeBob. Okay, so detalles, repitamos. Yo crecí, I grew up. I grew up. Tercer, tercer grado, third grade. Third grade. Responsible, de responsable, responsible. Responsible. She support me. Ella me apoyó. She support me. She support me. Excelente. Thank you, Adriana. Ok, señores, me despido. Me van a disculpar. Me pasé seis minutos. Así es que me van a disculpar, pero ya podemos ir a descansar. Ok, antes de que nos vayamos a descansar, quiero mencionarles lo siguiente. El día de mañana, eh, yo les voy a mandar en la mañana unas diez, unas diez preguntas básicas súper básicas, porque mañana voy a tener una conversación, pero no voy a hacer las 10 preguntas uno por uno. O sea, por ejemplo, Avi las 10 preguntas, Adriana las 10 preguntas, Paola las 10 preguntas. O sea, no, voy a pasarme de una persona, me voy a pasar a otra, porque quiero comenzar a hacer pinino de conversación. Y la única regla es que usted me debe de responder en inglés. Sin preguntarme, mire, Tiche, ¿cómo digo esto? Porque quiero ver qué tanto vocabulario manejamos hasta el momento. Así es que les voy a mandar las preguntas para que vayamos practicando, pero recuerde, de repente yo puedo comenzar con Claudia, de repente me puedo pasar a Valerie, de repente me puedo pasar con Violet, de repente me puedo pasar con Alex. Entonces, voy a ir jugando como que estuviéramos en círculo. Primero te pregunto a ti, después a ti tu opinión, ahora tú qué piensas, etcétera, etcétera. Señores, pasen una feliz noche. Nos vemos el día de mañana a las siete y media en punto. Good night, people. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Good night. Pero bye. Bye.